there's this gate a hundred yards ahead, and that's the beginning of the rat race. And what the gate leads to is this big maze full of dead ends, lots of cheese, and by the time you get out on the other end, you've had so many experiments done to you that you can no longer function. We're born in a stampede being pushed towards this gate, towards the gate of the rat race. And, you know, we, we wake up as we're tumbling forward and being trampled. For most people, they express to me how they feel that once they have gone through the gate, it's too late. That is how the battle will be lost. That is how it, that is how it has happened, and that is how it will happen. But this is how the battle will be won, is if we all realize that, and we realize how easy it is to slip into this apathy, how easy it is to believe that there is never going to be a change. Think back to the frustration of Galileo. You know, think about how hard it would be to convince people of a geocentric universe if, for hundreds of years, we've been raised to believe that the sun is at the center of the solar system, and then Galileo is trying to say maybe it's the Earth. We're trying to say maybe it's the Earth instead of people, instead of any organism. But it is catching on. It's like every day an awake soldier puts down his rifle and says, I'm going to go back to sleep. A sleeping soldier wakes up.